around scurry. time of day you are. Uh, what time of day it is. Looks <laughs> like a young Viking. That's hazing, dude. You can't haze people, Mr. Vikings. Let me bust your barrels. Oh, do you need to go back to little dude, though? Uh, give those little mini medals away. Is that a better what's up nerds tin can nobody wants to play chess with you okay yeah I was having problems with my mic being too soft so I think I turned the wrong thing up um, so sorry about that god look at all this gold I like gold It's like Sir Viking Man right there. Oh, that's nice Vikings. Ooh, Viking women. Are these Valkyries or is that something different? And that's just regular non Oh, that's, that's a dude. No, that is a girl. Promoted to what? Vice loser? Of course that's... Locked. Ugh. Freaking these Vikings and their secrets. Are these stalagmites or stalactites? I think the stalagmites because you might hit your head on them. Is that a thing? Did I just make that up? Maybe. Well, because the map doesn't show anything useful over here, I have to go over here. Because there's going to be something. Also, where are the baddies? This is, this is the music of the baddies. Look at that! A Brighton Rock. Totally useful. And I totally know what that is. Where's the little ticker talker to? Get out of here. Back in Sniffleheim. Oh, you can travel through these... What you call it? The wells. Oh, I was already in. No, I wasn't in this well. No. 
Hey, why why did the uh why why did the old guy fall into the well? It's because he didn't see that well. <laughs> why is there a whole house under this this well? This is a well house. Just like stuff? I don't know. Reported, thanks. I appreciate it. Hey, there's no such thing as bad publicity, am I right? Another Brighton Rock! Man, I gotta figure out what these are used for. Does it tell me? Uh, it's under items. Oh, it's a rock that's bright. Cool. I'm sure it's used for crafting. Man, I feel like that entire thing was wasted. I see a yeek. Oh, come on. See a Yggdrasil root, which means I'm gonna have to come back here at some point. But it won't let me do it now. Um, where am I supposed to go? This whole objective right now is literally just like go find stuff. I think I found. It's under important items. I think I found five out of the six important stuffs one two three four five yeah five out of six ain't bad can't they just say I won the game close enough bro you drunk come back here mr. slave his name's Dave. He looks like that, and his name's Dave. I just want to burn that into your memory. This bulky guy, shirtless, with leather, like, cross suspenders, with a sex dungeon mask that's pink. His name's Dave. I want you to find a guy named Dave and tell him that's what he looks like. That's what I want you to do. Alright, uh, where am I supposed to go? Literally, nobody knows where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> I mean, I guess I just go around. Yo. Gotta battle some baddies. Some chinchilla radus. Chillin' on. Dude, that's a hundred damage? That's insane. My dude is broken right now. Ka-snooze? Rab's dope. Maximum MP. I don't know what MP absorbed is. I don't know if we do that. Magical Mending, and this is probably Magical Might. No, let's just increase MP. Bup, 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 bup. Nickelodeon. Okay. Let's speed up. I wonder if, like, so the map doesn't show anything out there, but, like, I bet there's stuff way out there. Are there, like, dragons at the end of the world? Is that one of those things? Or is it just gonna, like, make me think I keep going when I really don't? Ooh, there are griffins at the end of the world. My life is in otter shambles. What? Bunny girl used hip drop. <laughs> it's a thing that actually happens. It actually happens quite a lot. This is like the, the stairs in Mario. 
I'm really not that far from land. Do I, am I getting any farther from land? I mean, yeah. The land's getting farther away. Oh, see, now I can't see the land. Am I gonna be on the other side of the map? Is this like some Christopher Columbus type shit? Ooh. The Flython. Or Dython. It's Dython. It's like a python that kills people. They call it a Dython. Yeah, I think this is like the Mario stairs. Turn the salty stallion around. I mean, I can see Yggdrasil. Oh, two Dithons. I'm gonna poison a poison. Two hundred and nineteen damage. Absolutely absurd. No. Mm, excuse me. Let's go for this little dude over here. It's not full of Titanic. Let's miss these icebergs. Dude, stop, bro. Dude, come on, dude. Kill them both. Uh, yes, play Lorelei's harp. Now see, this, it just takes me back here, but that's so dumb because now, ugh, I thought something cool would happen. That was literally just a waste. Why, <clears throat> why did they do that? Alright, alright. Stupid Dithons again? Oh, more Dithons. Come on, oh, man. Cook it, come on, oh, man. Used Cobra Strike on the Dithons. Nice. I guess I'm just going all the way around. So I see a teleporting thing. It's probably not where I need to go yet. All these stupid otter whatevers. Hella chapter. Islands probably not important. There's a lot of unimportant item islands. Oh, those guys are pretty gnarly. NGL.
Is there another item here? This is like the perfect place for an item. Coralosis, those guys are pretty cool too. I'm kind of surprised at how little or how infrequent the monsters actually charge you. Glass frit? Oh, there's a dude here. Oh, here we go. Oh, what? Oh, okay, I was about to say. Silver, silver, and a blue eye. Yeah. Uh, let's defeat this baddie and then the other baddie. Gaga! -ga! Oh, he was running away from me. That means I'm stronger than him. K.O. Nobody cares about Sylvando. You're not getting any points. Let's kill this guy too. What is this guy called? The Kriller. Thriller killer is what he is. <laughs> nice. Celestial scheme. Board the stallion. Huh. Tin Can, if you're listening, are you streaming right now? If so, I'll give you a quick watch. You're not streaming. Here. Is Tugboat streaming? Is it Tugboat or the good old, just good old Tugboat, okay. He's also not streaming. Ugh, whatever. Oh, he's, he's watching me though, that's cool. Anyway, anyway, in two ways. Where am I to go? Like, they make all these cool little islands and stuff, like little inlets. There's literally no point to this. There's nothing here. It's not like I can find stuff to do. Oh, I didn't think that was going to happen. Nice. So, Nice. See, like this little inlet, there's no point to this. Yeah, let's see what happens. I'm gonna be upset if this is a one-way thing. Okay, it's, it does not appear to be. Dude, stop, bro.
Can I follow this river? No. I guess I can't go through here either. Okay, so this is the only way to get to this little island. So that's probably an important island. Probably means something to somebody. As long as I can save right as soon as I get off of here. Central Island. That's dumb. Alright. Those are some big boys. That's a different kind of Coralossus. Oh my goodness. I don't like this at all. That's a... Oh, well, son of a... Come here. I'll kill you first. Mastodon. Yeah, he, he's a strong boy. He's... Ooh, big strong boy. There we go. Not something we can't kill, but like, it's gonna hurt. This is gonna be a fake chest, by the way. No, it's not. Okay. These stupid mini metals. I don't know what they're for. I don't want to fight those little droid deckers. These kind of things are everywhere, and I don't know how to unlock them. Oh, well, son of a dookie. There you go. But some of them have different locks for different doors. Well, I don't know. Maybe I don't know how to play this game. Okay, well, let's just go back to the boat. There's a bunch of big scaries over here. Back aboard the Stalliot! Vortex of light. Nice. Nice what? What do you mean, Brosif? I literally, I have absolutely no idea where I'm supposed to go. I think I need to go where would be the most inland? I probably need to go to somewhere on the inland sea and work my way up. Man, I just I just don't want to do that. <laughs> Oh, yo, these, are, these guys are dumb. Oh, she's pepped up. Pep, pep. Zam. He casts Zam, and I could cast Bam. I don't want to. Go to this island. Get some of this stuff. What's gonna be the name of this? Insular. Uh, what's his name for East? I don't know. Insular Eastus. Alright, let's try and figure this out. Hey Hannah, how you doing? How's life? Let's try to figure this out. Hornhopper. Oh, I have hit. 
Oh yeah, oh yeah. I knew it was something about the east, like the far east orientalis. These guys look so happy. I just want to slaughter them. Okay. Let's, uh... This is like a kind of cool place. Oh, big slime king. I feel like these are weak monsters for the most part. Silk Blossom. Free stuff? Where's my free stuff? Tony, man, I'm here to get free stuff and kill baddies. That is it. That's, that's all I'm here for. A slime crown. Sounds disgusting. Uh... Your equipment, you said? Yeah, it's in the item bag. The Rigo Regulia. That's just. That's dumb. That's like big dumb. Oh, there's something in the water. Celestial skein. I really gotta figure out what a skein is. I hear that word a lot. Big ol' slimy boy. This is big king slime. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Ooh, buddy. Yeah, that's probably a good call there, dog. Ooh. Don't kill him. Dang, okay. The next guy we kill, we're gonna get so much stuff from, because I, I know a little secret. Got a little secret here. Let, let me go first. Let me go first. Don't lose your pet. That's all I say. Okay. Fire and Grimstone? That's kind of cool. No. I like Hallelujah. Like Hallelujah. You just get so you get so much stuff. Buckets and oodles of stuff, it says. Start Oh, that's a king slime. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, have you played this before, Audrey? This is my first playthrough. I don't know anybody that else has played it other than, like, maybe one other person. I have five of the six orbs, and I am a little lost. <laughs> TBH on the last orb. Oh, did he just heal himself? Oh, that sucks. I'll kill him next time. Oh, there we go. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> oh, another slime crown. Cool, I already had that. Have you always been a Dragon Quest fan, or is this your first game? There's a movie on Netflix about it? What in the world? I didn't realize that. I honestly never heard of Dragon Quest until they put Hero in as a character in uh, in Smash, and then I got the demo of this game for free, and I was like, "Oh, this is kind of cool." And then I just played through the demo. Then I waited till it went on sale. But I'm actually a really big fan of this game. Have you beaten this game? Or how far have you gotten if you haven't beaten it?
Yeah, I think I need to zoom back to one of these towns. Um, I know I have more mini metal, so I'm going to go to the metal place. Oh, it does take long. Oh, you stopped when you met the mermaid? That was such an interesting story. But I actually didn't like the mermaid part because it was just like go back and forth five or six different times for the story to continue. Um, it was a good story though. I just didn't like how they implemented it in the game. Yeah, I think I need to go back here. I am. I am on YouTube and Twitch right now, as well as Facebook, obviously. Yeah. Like, it would make sense if I had to do stuff, but I literally just went back and forth, talked to the person, go back again, and just, it could have been done better. And that's how a lot of these challenges are. Like, I don't know if you got to the part with the mural lady. Because I don't think you have to do a lot of this stuff in order. But, um, the mural lady was also back and forth a lot. Stamp my album! Nice. Are there multiple pages of this book? Oh, there are multiple pages. Okay. I thought I got all the mini medals in the game, but there's no way. Okay. I already have a... Whatever, that's fine. Yeah, it's, it's very time-consuming. But I like it, so... Whatever. I don't know where I need to go. I think I need to go... Oh, what am I doing? Where's this place? No, this place. Come on. Hello. Dundrasil. That's the closest place to Yggdrasil. So I feel like I need to go there. Alright, <laughs> that's fair. See you, Audrey. Thanks for stopping by. This is Octagonia. This isn't where I thought it was. need to go. Paints over symbol locked up. Yep. But I need to find where those doors are. Well, Tugboat, I have Discord that people are free to hop into, so there's that. <laughs> the thing is, though, my Discord link is in the Twitch chat. I need to 
I guess post my Discord link in the Facebook thing as well. Dude, I have absolutely no idea where I need to go. I feel like, see, what, where would I get? Dude, I don't know. Let's try this out. Have I gone to Mount Pang Lai? I feel like I, ha I have to have. Oh, this is this is where I can ride the slime knights. These guys are super cool. I can find a slime knight to ride. Probably just kill them all in one hit. <laughs> yeah, one regular hit kills them. Yeah, this is okay. GG's, boys. I don't know what that slime drop is. Alright, Tugboat, you need to look at this. I don't know if you're actually watching the stream. My dude rides a slime. I stole his slime and he's still like holding on and he just I just bounce around. <laughs> it's just this is this is all I do. Just ta da Yeah. See him holding on to his little slime? And I just stole it. And this is pure thigh power by the way. I'm not holding on with any hands. I stole this guy's sword and shield because I don't have a sword and shield. I have a great sword, which is like a two handed weapon. And I can just like defeat people in the overworld without battling them. <laughs> because like, I don't know. Guess that's a thing. There we go, butterfly wing. I feel like I wasn't allowed to go up here last time. Or maybe I just didn't want to, I don't know. Sorry about that. Got the sneezies. Get out of here. Is this Pang Lai Mountain? Why can't I go here? So I probably need to go back to Heliodor, honestly. That's where I started this whole mess. I just don't want to go there, because I'm going to have to fight people. Well, let's unmount. Unmount, hello, dismount. Go to the Mangle Grove. Which the mango grove? Whatever. Where is the mango grove? Yeah, this should be actually where I want to go. This is more towards the tree, I think. But I've been to the mango grove. Yeah. So I need to go north, the Heliodorian foothills. Oh, except I freaking can't. 
Oh, because I gotta go back to the woodcutter's hut? Is that what I... Oh, boy. Okay. Well, map of nearby spruce. Okay, well, let's zoom to downtown Heliodor real fast. Or can I? Well. Well, I guess I could go to Ticker, Ticker, Tickington, Tickockerton. Because I have a lot of those kind of things that I need to catch up with. So, I'll do that. Oh, I gotta talk to this guy. Is that what I have to do? Yep. Alright, let's go to Tickington. Yep. Hey, Rachel. Finally decided to watch. I'm about to go into 2D mode. 2D or not 2D? That is the question. Boop, boop, boop. Welcome to Tickington, home of the Tockles. It is our duty to watch over the passage of time. Oh, this is the inn? I don't care about the inn. I literally never use the inns or the banks. This is the church. This is, I guess, just some house, maybe? That's just some dude. He's just growing like carrots and stuff. Yeah, all right, I'm gonna go replay some of these uh, past lives or whatever. It's your own. All right. Oh, it's only the lit up ones. Okay, that makes sense. The altar of the heavenly bride. Oh, there's like multiple save files. Oh, this one's gonna be fun. Go to the Neverglade. It's like the Everglade, but like the opposite. Yeah, so Tugboat, if you are not caught up, basically the Talkertons are these little dudes that are responsible for making sure time passes at a smooth rate. They're in charge of the past, present, and the future, and like kind of that handoff of transition. Um, but somebody tried to rewrite history and destroy their ancient texts. So I have to go back and basically, I, th I think what's happening is I'm defeating the final boss of previous Dragon Quest games, but I'm doing so to in to make sure that the past flows smooth smoothly and we don't destroy our future. To the land of Nod. Sure. I feel like I don't really have a choice. And that item kind of sucks, but I'm going to do it anyway. Yeah, it's super trippy, dude. Especially because this is all 2D. Anyway, if you know, whatever. I don't care what you have to say. One of one of those days. What a nice pun. A pew. Wait, could I have gone the other way? I could have gone the other way. The only thing I don't like about 2D is you can't avoid enemies as easily. Oh, this is a nice place to rest. Well, I thought so. Can I not rest here? Hello. I really need to heal. Like my MP's kinda low. 
I'm like super mad there's no map either. What's that water do? Is this just gonna take me back to the beginning? I think it is. Yeah, okay. So I could go down. Let's take it back up. It's kind of a dumb maze, TBH. Alright, uh, I got a chest though. Seed and magic, that's kind of cool. So I can take me back to that place that I was just at. It is... There's nobody. Oh, it's a fairy. It is a fairy. But see, okay, here's the thing. This is what I don't like about Japanese culture. The whole point of Veronica is that she... Can I... Well, I can't show you right now. She's a twin sister. And her job, they're like... She's these like almost like nuns, but not really nuns. Just like these spiritual ladies and they're tasked with making sure the luminary which is me fulfills his mission so they are like religiously charged with making sure i complete this game which like sucks for them because i'm not doing so well but they're they're kind of i mean they're i guess in their 20s but something happened to veronica and her magic power got sucked out and that made her look younger so it's one of those, she looks like a little lolly kiddo person, but she's actually, oh, she's actually older, so it's fine. So you can sexualize this kid because she's fine. But only actual kids can see fairies. And she's the only one that can see this fairy right now, which means she's actually a kid. What, what are you doing, Japan? Be consistent. I don't get it. I just... I don't get it, man. Come on, Zaddy. This way. That makes me want to go the other way. Ugh. Well, I don't want to go this way. But, but I don't want to... That gummit. Oh, that's where I just came from? Wait, I just went that way. Oh, I guess I didn't. <laughs> yeah, poke it. <sighs> this fight. A daisy. A, like the dazed fight abilities oh they changed the order of my moves what sly dogs nice I don't know why you would use that move but oh you can put the daisy to sleep oh what an idiot I kind of woke him up. Sorry about that, bud. Also, in the 3D world, so I have a, a vest that heals me every turn, and Jade has a scepter that restores her magic powers every turn. In the 3D world, those actions occur before your move. In this world, they appear to happen after your move, which might be the difference, especially for Jade. If she can, that means she has to basically wait a whole nother turn before she potentially has enough magic power to use a move that she wanted to use. <laughs> nice. Death dance? <laughs> what? They just you just straight up killed me? What? <laughs> Excuse me. 
How? How are you just gonna kill me like that? Nice. But still. Why would you not use, uh... Is it Zing to, to fight? Oh, Rab. This is no good. Can I change a lineup on the fly? Hmm, nice. I can't change a lineup on the fly. Okay. Now we fight. Nice. Haha! -ha! Gotcha, bitch. Victory! Yeah, also these like replays are actually like, very um what's the word? Like made easy how much does she have oh she's got plenty oops It must be like the old school stuff. Oh, not what I wanted to do. Zaddy, Eric, Jade, Rab. Okay. One of those days. Yeah, you better. Cool. Dude, Sylvando's like very homosexual. I right. uh, 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 on to the next one. Wait, so if I were to go back up there... No. So do all of these have three different things to go to? That's crazy. Dang, calling him out. A slob like Ortega really should be thinking about getting married. He's so uncouth and boorish. He'd make his wife's life a misery. There's nothing surer. Now he'd be doing the world a big favor by staying single and letting his bride be find someone better. Bah! Then talk about my boy. Poor as a church mouse. Dang. They're talking mad shit about this dude.
Hmm. There's defuddle drops. <laughs> of course they're called defuddle drops. Uh, I don't think I've got it in me to go looking for such a thing. Sure. Oh, gold rosary. That's actually probably nice. Somewhere the Celestrians live. Nice. I don't care about you. Shut up. Shut, shut your mouth. How do I get out of here? What? What? <laughs> I am trapped. Wait. I missed something. That's definitely the door at the bottom. Well, I don't know about that one. Let's go to that one. And the altar of the legendary line. Moonahan. Doggos. Woof woof woof. Oh they oh they're all doggos. Oh I can't buy armor or nothing from them doggos. Thou wondrous who I am, perhaps? In truth I am princess of the realm in which thou standeth, fair moonbrook. Alas, Tis a realm much diminished, an evil wretch named Hargon, a priest in the service of pure wick wickedness. A wretch? Priest? So is it a guy or a girl? Can guys be wretches? I guess they can. Anyway, did burn my home, the castle to the ground, and curse me to take the form of a dog. Find myself banished to Moonaham, where did spend many a miserable day whimpering and whining at my sorrow fate. And then, wherefore I know not, oh, I missed it, shoot. Truly it seemeth that it bring disaster wheresoever I do roam. First the castle is destroyed, now my curse has been inflicted on the scores of innocence. Yet there may be a solution. I once heard of a spell from the time of mighty Erd Erdic. Sheen was its name, and it was said to be capable of lifting any curse. From what I gathered, tis an incantation beyond my meager magical means, but I too acquire the enchanted elixir, but were I to acquire the enchanted elixir known as magic water, I might perhaps eke out a single casting. This being so, I would humbly beg of you, bring me a draught of that ensorcelled liquid. Okay. That I might lift the curse of the afflicteth, the poor people of this town. You've been asked to take requests. I will blah blah. Did you? Here you go. Be thou capable. Whatever. I already have it. So you can just have it. The curse of the curs. Oh, like cur dogs. Yep. Go for it. Okay. Yep. That's the perks of never using items ever. You just have whatever they need all the time. Oh, shut up and just use it. Nay, we must speak of such things another time. The townspeople can be suffered to wait no longer for the lifting of the curse that ails them. My magical powers are meager, but with this enchanted elixir at my disposal, they may just suffice. For all thou hast done for me, rest assured that thou hast my undying gratitude. Now, let us pray that our efforts may not have been in vain. Boop, boop, boop. Casting sheen. <laughs> wah, 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 wah. Fire punt. <laughs> what? <laughs> Fire punt? I don't even know what that means. 
Fire Punt. Fire Punt! My powers alone will not suffice to banish this pernicious course. Nay, I must take its wicked magic upon mine own self once again. But if that, if that is what it will take to deliver the people of Moonahan from its clutches. Aw, what a nice little lady. <laughs> Yikes. That kind of sucks. TBH. Like, good on you, but like, that sucks. Prithee, stranger, wilt thou hear my sorry tale? Fear that I mis mislaid my precious Tombola ticket to find that it had been cast rudely into a hole somewhere dug in the mud. <laughs> what manner of a cur would do such a thing? I think cur means wild dog. I've heard people talk about cur dogs before. Uh, I was a town where none remain stranger, but we're not strangers. Have we met before? Have we not? But where? Forgive me. Tis not. A dream, perhaps. Ahem. <laughs> Literally, I still can't buy any of this stuff. I don't care what any of y'all have to say. Yeah, this this kind of stuff would be a lot cooler if I had played the older games, but I haven't. So I, there's a lot of references I don't get, but it's fine. And all of these little town things that I'm going to, they don't have passwords. They have past words. Because they're words of the past. To help you go back in time, like in the past. Oh, this is like dragon stuff. Which we to choose as the form which you be beginning with the one next to me there in order a wetling, a dwarf, an elf, a poppet, and an ogre. No clan was you born as ogre, but the most powerful of the tribes, least in terms of brute strength. But I do not want to be a troll at all. That is different altogether. Trolls are different from ogres, you stupid. Wit? Okay. The wetlings, probably your. Mm. How to. Yeah. That's definitely a troll, not an ogre. Troll best, ogre rubbish, ogre roll. Oh, so are these not what they're supposed to be? Oh, all of these are wrong. Okay. That's funny. Okay. <laughs> A lump mage. Yikes. That's interesting. Well, what, what does the kissling say? Kisser. That's disgusting. And sexually immoral. Tinton. It's a place situated on a remote island where we've been free to live our lives in peace until now, but then everything changed once the Fire Nation attacked. One day, without the slightest warning, a horde of monsters descended upon the village and burned it to the ground. We lost our lives in the carnage, along with many of our kith and kin. As they were wrenched from our bodies, our spirits heard a voice from above. It told us that we had a destiny to fulfill, and that we were to be reborn as members of one of the five tribes. The same voice led us here, and then suddenly it was gone. It was then that a fiend appeared and announced himself as the Revivalist. He told us that he would not permit us to be reborn as one of the five tribes, but that we must instead take the form of monsters. As you might imagine, this was none too tempting an offer. Thus we find ourselves stuck. To rid this room of monsters who occupy it, the Revivalist must be hunted down and defeated. But in our current form, this feat is beyond us. Please, will you come to our aid? 
Uh, sure. I have nothing better to do. Uh, he declared that he was determined to find an instrument called the Lyre of Iron. I've heard that before. He's a form of an old man. The Trails of Lyre. I have so many quests going on. I don't know where any of this crap is. I thought I just had to beat these monsters. It'd be so much easier. I feel like a lot of these, they have like two or three stages. I feel like I can't beat this until I get to the second password. Hello to the two new people that just joined in on Twitch. Um, I'm close-ish to the end of the game, I think, but I can't find that sixth orb, so I'm going through and doing this side quest thing that I'm really confused about. So, if you're confused, join, join the crowd, honestly. Um, but feel free to say hey in the chat, tell me how you've been this week, let me know what's going on. Uh, did you know the goo rate big tree that's center of the observatory is called Yggdrasil? Oh, that's Yggdrasil? But there's also a Yggdrasil in the 3D world. Interesting. People gooing about the place with great big wings called Celestrians. Oh, this is the Celestrian. Okay. Hmm, interesting. Ruby Path of Doom. I don't know what any of that means. Sounds scary though. Go figure. What are these stupid puns? I think it's funny that figs are their god fruit because... At least in Christianity, Jesus cursed a fig tree because of how barren it was. Which is like a really weird... Like, I, I don't understand the significance of it, and I don't want to pull a lot of context from it when I don't understand it. But it was like... I think, basically, Jesus wanted to go eat from a fig tree, and it didn't have any fruit. So he cursed it, saying that it would never bear fruit again to anybody, and it would just wither away and die. Uh, but here, these celestial beings love fig trees. And so... I... Okay. And this is a weird mixture of, like... Obviously, Yggdrasil is Norse, and there's a lot of Norse mythology, but it's a Japanese game, so there's also a lot of Japanese, like, Shintoism and, like, other spirituality... Spiritu spiritualities in there. The photo drops. Oh. Is he gonna give me? Oh, he's gonna give me the photo drops? Oh shoot, okay. Where was... Oh, so I have to go between worlds. Oh, this is gonna suck. I think I had to go here for the photo drops. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. Here's a future home. Okay. Oh my goodness. I like this little music though. It's hopping. Ah, there you are. Now, would I be in right thinking you've managed to get a hold of the photo drops? Oh, how wonderful. You did it. You really did it. There's no time to lose. We need to find out if everyone really opposes my marriage or if they were just cursed. Halt! Everything's going so well and you had to go into fear, didn't you? If you use these drops, you undo the curse I wrought so lovingly. What an idiot. What an idiot. Call yourself out. Gloves are off. You're like some little devil dude. I'm gonna kill you. Fight to the death. Oh, he's just a, a lud... He's Archfiend's I Acolyte. 
I don't know what that means, but like you can die. Two hundred and seven damage from one hit. Dag gun. Wait, I'm hallucinating. What does that mean? Okay. Oh, because Eric's hallucinating. That's probably why he's not taking any damage. Nice. Because it took so long to come back and do these, I'm still fairly overleveled. Oh, nice. Nah. Oh, so this is probably the hero from a previous game's parents. That's ridiculous. I wonder if that's canonically my parents or if that's like... I, there's so much I don't know about this game because I, I think it's similar to Link in Legend of Zelda how it's Link, it's all Link, but he just recurs throughout time so it's not really the same Link. So I don't think these would be my parents, but they're the parents of the past hero. Um, yeah. I don't know. It's going to be wild. I don't think these are my parents. My parents died. But this is also back in time. Ugh. I don't know. Yeah, you will. Yeah, endangered engagement. Shut up. I don't want to break these little dudes. That's it. Man, I'm sneezing like I got Dorona. Altar of the Cursed King, Chateau Felix. Oh, my hat's screwed up. What are we doing here? There we go. They all cats. Yawn. Meow. Those are like little griffins, right? I think these are griffins. Qatar, Chateau Felix, residents of the great saber cat father, Master Felix. What does that mean? There's nothing to do? That's cool. That's, that's cool. I don't want to be here, no way. I'm like out of the frame. What am I doing here, man? Here we go. Let's get centered with this webcam. All trades, Abby. All all trades. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Absolute bedlam. <laughs> My 
What is it with bunny girls in this stupid game? Nice. Shocker, the bunny girl library doesn't have anything of interest. Shocker. Let's go on, talk to the king, my child. Do I wish to change paths? Nice. <laughs> I just okay I, I don't know if I already have that book Fashion advice. So I, oh, I do have that book. That was in the the um the all girls school. I forget what it's called. It's like French something something medalis. In the library there, they gave you a book of recipes on how to make bunny girl outfits. I am I bet that's what it is. I get a golden pickaxe. I wonder what that's. Thogies just want to have fun. That's. That's the name of the quest. Fogies just want to have fun. Oh, I don't have the book. Oh, I don't have the book. It's not here, is it? It's... That'd be dumb if it was just here. Dadgummit, am I, am I going to have to go back to that place? Ugh, poop on a stick, man. Where did I just go? Did I just go there? I just... Yeah, I can't really go to any of these. Because I bet they go by based off the ones that are not done. That gummit. Oh man. All right, back to square one. I don't know what I'm doing. I've got to go back to ye old 3D world. Ugh, gross. And now we have 3D bunny girls. Ugh. I don't know where to go. Do I need to go back to the door of departure? Because... Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the door of departure. This was precisely where the demo ran out. So I remember farming this area fairly well because like the demo was you couldn't get past that wall back there, but you were allowed to keep playing in this area. So I got severely overpowered, which was fantastic. Like the beginning of this game was fairly difficult. And uh, I got to this point, and I was like, man, I am killing it. Alright, let's heal up, maybe rework some items. Boop, boop. Yes.
that uh I don't really care about any of these. Uh Pred's protection against attack is only for confusion. Poison paralysis, sleep abilities, bedazzled mesmerization curses I kind of do want this dogged collar I do do I want to use the only dragon hide I have I think I do if I get a dogged collar on myself that'd be pretty nice and I did save before this so if I screw it up I'll just go back Nice. Double whammy. Ooh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Um, shoot, 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 flourish. Let's do a lightning bash up here. Nice. Okay, 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 okay. Should I just bash this? I have 42. I might as well lightning bash all the way. Oh, that's too much. Dogged collar plus three. Let's go, boys. Let's get, 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 go. Perfection. Literally the the exact opposite of wasting my dragon hide. Five perfectionist pearls. Dag gum. Weapons. I haven't learned any cool weapons really. I mean, that's a cool sword, but I don't have any, like, one-handed swordsmans. The cast iron greatsword, that, that took me a long... I used that a while. Let's see if we can make any armor. Uh, armor. I wonder how to make bunny ears. But I want the. Oh, I do want to go back and get the pumpkin stuff. Okay, am I gonna make all the Drazillion stuff? I might as well make this and give it to myself. Give myself the Drazillion armor. Cause that's the, the health I re recover per thing isn't really that great, TBH. Nope. Son of a biscuit. Oh boy, okay. This sucks. <laughs> I've really screwed that one up. Oh, it's still got plus one though, so that's not bad. Still got five pearls. So let's make the helmet. 
Drazilian helm. I'm tired of looking the same way. TBH. <laughs> but hey, I like it. I'm literally down to zero, so yes, I'm done. Is it plus three? No, because I didn't get any like perfectly. So yeah, plus two. That's kind of cool. I'm just beefing myself up. <laughs> like, forget everybody else in my party. Dang gun. I need to go double check what those actually mean. Okay. So, resistant to sleep. Okay. Yeah, this is exactly what I want. <laughs> yes! <laughs> look at look at my character, the Drazilian. <laughs> this is beautiful. I want everybody to have custom outfits. That that's what I want. Everybody to have custom outfits. Hey, hey, go heal, or save, or whatever. Here we go. Alright. So I'm gonna go back to... The door of departure. Actually, I would try this cryptic cavern. I don't remember what's over there. I like how you can hear the armor, like, move. Probably just, like, bronze. Oh, it's iron. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Iron and copper. Here we go. Come on. There we go. Vanishing blade? That's definitely a two handed weapon. Kind of a weak one. That's kind of cool, but I'd rather just have raw attack. Have I been in the cryptic cavern? What is, what is in the cryptic cavern? This part doesn't seem as familiar to me. But I'm sure I've been here. Oh, I do remember this. Yeah, this, I do remember this. Okay. I actually had a really tough time with this place at the beginning. 
but I'm sure I could just absolutely destroy everybody in there now. Um, I'm gonna... Not cheap, I'm gonna hail my horse. Good. Dang, what is my cape doing, man? These tomato slimes. This is where I first met, um... The two, the twins is. Yeah, door of departures is there. I got an orb at the beginning place earlier. I don't think there's really any reason for me to go back. But truthfully, I don't know where else to go. Oh. Well. I guess there's places I still haven't gone. Lana Lulu. I don't remember Lana Lulu. Let's let's check out this place. Bye bye horse. No what? Why would you not have me docked here? Stupid. Oh, Mama Lulu. This place seems familiar. Yeah, I know I've been here, but like I don't remember anything about this place. Oh, this is the mermaid place. I thought the mermaid place. Really? That was the mermaid place? Well, son of a biscuit eater. Where do I go? How do I get to Yggdrasil? So I basically I need to go to Yggdrasil. The snare fell. I'm gonna try going back there because there was that dragon that I need to awaken, I guess. I guess I didn't go to the Arborean Highlands. This is the place of the dragon. Let me see if I can awaken the dragon. This is 
definitely some bad guy I need to defeat at some point. I definitely have not been here. Yikes, big trolls. Two hundred and forty damage. Get wrecked, boy. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, I don't think I've been to Agoria, so this might be the place to go. Because if I check maps of local areas... Okay, okay, here's where I'm supposed to go. Oh, yikes. Big boy. Is that a troll? No, that's not a troll. And the runny eggs and stuff. Cyclops. Nice, got him. Yeah, get me. Tag gum. Nice. <laughs> we gotta heal Rab. That's yes, fifteen. He could probably get some stuff. Might as well. I mean. So I'm going to need these two to get this. But I'm going to get all the guile first. Because it's probably some stupid... I don't know. Ignore those guys and uh, keep moving. Oh, do I need one of those? Come here, you runny egg so skeleton.
kind of cool. Nice. Nice mini metal. Zaboria, the land of the trees. It's like a very Grecian. What's the difference in Greek and Grecian? One's like the, the race of people and one's like the architecture, I think, or something like that. I don't know. マルティナさんたら自分の故郷を知る。うん。はい。この地こそ私たちの故郷。ナイス。Cool, another cutscene. Just what I wanted. Ugh. How do they recognize Veronica if she's like a little kid now? There we go. There we go. Look how freaking important I look in my Drusillian armor. Benedictus. I what a beautiful name. こうして the path to the forest lies beyond the cathedral, as of course you know. But as you are. We need, where is the freaking last orb, though, is the thing. I don't know where the last one's going to be. I have five of the six. Also, I really love this armor. Like, <laughs> freaking stylish. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Hey, y'all are cool. I don't care about you. What? Oh, yeah, Serena's. Okay. So, this is Veronica and Serena's house. It's her dad, Fidelis. What do they say their names are? So Benedictus was the good word, Holy Father. Fidelis is the faithful man. What was her name? Alma. I don't know what Alma means. That's also Latin. All of these words are very Latin in origin. The birth of Aborea. Dark One first arrived the lands of Verderia. Hero came forth and the aid of companions. Set out the quest. 
in the tyranny of evil, the hero's illuminary. That's me. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Cool. Keepers. Nice. It's all about me. It's an ancient book entitled Keepers Dreamers. Not more than once every few hundred years or thereabouts, a child is born in, in Aborea, whom the gift of foresight is granted. A foresight is found in dreams. A night visions come to the recipients of this gift, visions that tell of the future. Over the century, these visions have saved countless souls from misfortune. However, scant little is known of the origins of the sacred power. One tantalizing theory posited by the scholars of old is that the gift was received from the ancient inhabitants of the land whereupon the village stands, inhabitants who disappeared into the very skies. So we were already, we were talking to the celestial beings earlier. Are they from the Aborea? Seed of Therapeutus. Okay, so therapeutic seed. Um... Supplicant, okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. Oh. All right. Oh, there's no armor in this holy city. Let's save the game. So I probably need Okay, well that kind of basically told me where I need to go. I need to go to the mountaintop. I kind of want to try the first forest and grove of repose as well. Oh, I can't because they're that's behind the cathedral. Okay, well let's try the grove of repose. What are you gonna do, Toga Boy? That's gay. Wishteria. Yeah, okay, so get some wisteria, bring it back a little sick girl. There's probably gonna be more to do here later. This is one of those areas that's like, oh, super important, but absolutely useless right now. Okay. On to the first forest. Of course, the Ar of course Arborea would have the first forest. Man, I feel like if you don't speak Japanese or Latin, you're like severely hindered in this game. Luckily, I know a little bit about both. Not much of either, but a little bit about both. Nice. Still don't know what a skein is. As many times as I've seen that in this game. Serena and Veronica are just like uh, local heroes. Hmm. This statue is created as a counterpart to another, that of the Luminary, which stands in the ancient Dundrasil. Indeed, it would seem that the fates of those two great statues were wedded to one another as those of their subjects. So, 
So, dear reader, should your travels ever take you to Dundrasil, be sure be sure to pay your respects to mighty Erdwin. Who knows what benefits best the blessings of others' great monuments may be. Okay, that's interesting. Some cool lore. I was about to say, yeah, that's definitely Serena. That's cool. Alright, let's go up here to the, uh... So, the Benedictus was the one with the vision? That's cool. Pseudonym. <laughs> Pseudonym, okay. Sniffle, I'm a summer village high priest. The last father of Jordan, so I'm alive and well as a warrior offering myself. And the desert doctor, a choice between two great treasures. Beautiful branch. Oh, the rainbow, yeah, 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 yeah. Small, oh, the blue light, okay. It was a magical artifact that opened the door of departure. Nice. Kind of cool little backstory to those two items. Elfin elixir. Oh come on! So I do need the sixth stone. Oh my goodness, this is gonna suck. Well, where else haven't I been? Come on, okay. for me timbers so I guess you can go to gondolia yeah so there's a couple things I need to go to gondolia okay so let's let's go to gondolia Well, oh, here we go. Back to Gondolia we go. Hashtag weeb. I don't know what that was in reference to, the hashtag weeb, but it was probably accurate, so I'm not going to fight it. Was that about me knowing Japanese and Latin? Well, Gondolia is where the casino is. So I didn't finish all my quests. I got super distracted by the casino. And the bunny girls. The bunny girl casino. No, this is not the bunny girl casino. This is the, the cat. Cat hat. Pretty cat suit. 10,000 gold coins. We have a deal? Yes. Okay, let's... Here we go. 
I would make her defense go down. But she... <laughs> It'd make you go down a lot. That's fine. She's in a cat suit. Dude, it's it happens. <laughs> She's in the Who? What is this? Oh, cuz she also has that. Okay. What was the other one she had on? No. So we have cat girl, school girl, and bunny girl. Up up paired up with a uh, super platinum armor guy. So we just need cool guy Eric to get a suit, old guy Rab to get a suit, and gay guy Silvando to get a suit. Which that is a interesting whip you got there, gay guy Silvando. In two ways. What am I doing? What what am I doing? Let's go to the docks real fast. There's something about some boat. Some boat. And last time I was here, I got like chased out of town. Oh, it's it's the night time now. The time of the night. Luckily, I am a creature of the night. Skiba. Excuse me. Molto evidente. Nope. So what am I supposed to do? Go to my quests. I've been asked to grab some proper pepper from a pack of pirates near Gondolia. Head for the desert island they call home. Okay, so the desert island near Gondolia, but this... I've been asked to help a mermaid find a little boy whose songs she used to enjoy. So this I actually need to find... Some singing boy. Which, he's probably a singing old man now. Some mermaids live like five ever. Ooh, is this the bard I'm looking for? Grandi Musculoso. Don't care about none of this stuff. Let's go find me some little dudes to talk to. Little brothers. Oh, there was. There's like a gate or something I couldn't get into. I wonder if I can get into that now. I used to be able to jump off this, I thought. Huh? Yeah, let's try and get in this locked door here. Oh, it's this gate. I'm not going to be able to get in this gate.
This is ridiculous, dude. You're a scholar. Well, I can at least go to the, uh, what you call it? No place with the thing. Okay, let's see if there's something I can use to boost, what's your call it's, um, defense. Is that an accessory? It is. Sure, his fishnet stockings, which I can, I guess I can get rid of. It's plus eight defense, plus thirteen defense. So that's definitely. Which I guess technically. I can equip the spangled dress and still have the cat suit. Yeah. That's that's probably the best way to do that. That's cool. That would make her defense go down again. But it would make her might mending go up a good bit. It's probably the best best bet. That's fine. Because really, I just wanted to have the cat suit. I don't really care about her. Like, I don't want to lower her stats. But we got Bunny Girl, now we got Kitty Girl. And we also have School Girl, so. Oh, that's cool. Stuff. The Australian Island. I should be able just to wax everything here, so I'm not super worried about my health and safety. Some of these have red doors, and I can open the red doors. Some of them have metal gates. I can't open the metal gates. Those slime crowns are utterly useless. Okay, well this evidently is not where I need to be then. Well, where am I supposed to go? I'm gonna find out where I need to go and it's gonna be brilliant because I have absolutely no idea right now. I'm just gonna go back to every little place that I've been at. Check this place again. The Emerald Coast. See, that's another door of the. 
Oh, this was... Oh, okay, okay, okay. This was the beginning place, though. This is where I started out. So this might be where I need to go, actually. See, it, do I have all the maps of the nearby areas? Kingsborough. Oh, I do have this, okay. So I can at least go to Heliodor and get on the other side of the Mangle Grove. You going to Heliodor? Yeah, I need to hang out. I guess I can lead the way. Okie dokie. Yeah, this was like way back in the beginning. I mean, I guess I could go back to Cobblestone and see what's going on. I, it's that one last orb. I don't know where it is. I'm actually going to go back to Cobblestone for a second. See if there's anything to do there. That's the opposite of where I need to go. And this is where I need to go. I don't know if this is correct, but it can't be any more wrong than anything else I've been doing this like entire game. Let's go like talk to my mom, see what's going on. Let's go talk to my mommy. No, oh, my mommy's this way. <laughs> so much for my mom. My mom must be like dead, dead. Mommy! Okay, well, let's... Oh, there's a red door here. i gonna drop down here. Oh, boy. How did that not kill me? Okay. Well, now where are we going? Look at that. 
Restored it. Okay. Probably heals your like health or MP or something like that. Let's go back to Heliodor. Those stairs are jank. I don't I'm not worried about them stairs. I can see Yggdrasil. I can see it on the map. Why can't I go there? Oh, the gates can be closed. Okay, no, I guess not. There's a quest. That's probably the books. Ugh, this doesn't make any sense. I guess we can go to the castle. Excuse me, got the burps. Dang it. Okay, so I where's the sixth orb? Eastern part of town. So let's let's go to the eastern part of town.
Nice. Nice. Let's get back and solve this quest. So that did nothing. supposed to go. the sixth orb. He's capable of hitting a falling tree leaf from miles away with a crossbow. Okay. Okay. Where the heck is this stinking orb? This is so, so dumb. I don't want to Google this, but I, I, I don't know where it is. I've been to all of these places. I guess the only one I maybe haven't been to oh, what is this? Zward Rust? Yeah, I have definitely been to Zward Rust. Let's work out the yellow one. Where's that place in the middle there? Heliodor City? I guess some of those places are close to the world tree up top. Dendrosil. I already went there. That's, that's a new guy. I mean, I guess I gotta go back to Arborea, but like, where? Ugh. Well, that's kind of cool. Huh? <laughs> 
Okay, I realize that. Where is Mordecai? Do we need to go back to already, already, uh, Octavia? Oh, that's cool. So it tells me where I haven't gotten. Zero in visits. Okay. So they came from in an A place. Let's zoom to Octagonia. up here I don't know if I actually did anything up here to be honest with you guys Is there nowhere for me to go in the middle? This is dumb. I'm very confused. That's cool, you freaking cheater. <laughs> so 
So I can't even go there anymore. Ugh. Understand what's going on here. I guess I could go try those ruins of Dundrasil again. That's not where we're meant to go. Whoops. Sorry about that. Let's see if I can figure out how to do stuff. No, I do want to go to the war dressed. I've been to those ruins, but I want to go to these ruins. Can I just knock him out? Yep. I'm not worried about any monsters at this point. I know I'm not going to be able to open one of those doors, but the other one I might be able to. Aha! Look, it's big brain time. Goodness gracious, I knew there was something I had to do here. This Is this the one I can't open? It's like magic. No, this is the one I can't open. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, finally. Nice. These, these are gonna be fake. Nice. Okay, it was just here. Finally, okay. Who 
Head east through snare fell and climb to the first horse. Okay. Are these gonna be mimics? Oh, nice. But the other one, I still can't get in the other one. I don't understand what's going on there. Um, I could try the other side. I, I don't think I'm able to get in. Uh, nor do I know how to get there. Just walk across this acid, it's fine. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to get in here. This one's like locked magically. I don't know how to break that seal. Okay. Zoom to Arbolia. Arborea. So I'm gonna heal and save. That's gonna be it for tonight. Cause that that was a piece of crap. <laughs> Go through all that, which I. I think whenever I got that magic key, they told me to go back there, but I didn't know where it was. So, I, that might have been on me, but either way. Actually, I'm just going to save. I'm close enough to full. Alright. Well, I'm hopping off for tonight. Uh, thank you guys for coming. This was <laughs> a bit more rambly than I meant for it to be towards the end because I had no idea what I was doing. But whenever I hop back on next time, we should have some action-packed story waiting for us. So that'll be good. Uh, cool. Thank you guys. You have a good night, and I will see.